Welcome to this video on apical views. The apical area is located between the midclavicular line and the left lateral chest wall as shown. You may also palpate the point of maximum impulse on the chest wall and place the probe in that area. These views are also obtained with the marker on the ultrasound probe pointed towards the left or the three o'clock position. Using a similar technique as previously shown in other videos, you will slide within intercostal spaces until you find an adequate window to the heart. Once you see the heart shadows, you may have to rock or fan your probe to improve the image. Let's start with the apical four-chamber view. Since our marker is pointing towards the left, the left-sided structures are on the same side as the marker. The thick-walled left ventricle is seen with the right ventricle adjacent to it and the interventricular septum in between. Here is the left atrium and the mitral valve between the left atrium and ventricle. The right atrium is adjacent to the left atrium and the tricuspid valve between the right atrium and ventricle. The apical four-chamber view can look identical if the orientation marker is pointing towards the right or nine o'clock position instead of the left. For this reason, it is important to note that the tricuspid valve is slightly apically displaced compared to the mitral valve. Knowing this anatomic pearl will help you distinguish the mitral and tricuspid valves. The next view obtained in the apical region is the apical five-chamber view. This view is important as it is used to calculate stroke volume and cardiac output in the ICU setting, which will be discussed in a separate video. To obtain the five-chamber view, start by obtaining the four-chamber view and slowly fan the probe anteriorly as shown in the video. The fifth chamber is the aortic valve with the left ventricular outflow tract seen between the left ventricle and the aortic valve. All other structures are the same as shown in the four-chamber view previously. Those are the apical views you need to know. Thanks for watching.